hey friends welcome or welcome back to my channel so we made it to walgreens and apparently i forgot to record myself walking in the store but i am going to be doing two different transactions today using two different cards so one of my cards got a spend 20 get five and the other one got spend 15 get five. Oh my goodness but both transactions i'm going to be building up that way i can have a low out of pocket use Walgreens cash to pay and still get my Walgreens cash back. So let's get started. All right, so these are the deal of the week, in my opinion anyway. So these Walgreens sugar-free cough drops are buy one, get one half off, buy two, get a $5 register reward. So apparently only the yellow is printing the register reward. So I'm gonna grab two of these for $2.68. I'll pay that, get back a $5 register reward. That'll make both of these a $2.32 money maker. Now I'm gonna do the deal of the week. So it's buy three, get back $5 in Walgreens cash. So I'm gonna grab two of these Huggies diapers, the 32 count, they are two for $21. Then I'm gonna add in this Scope mouthwash. This is on sale for $4. So all of this is gonna total me $25. I have a $4 off two digital for the Huggies, a $1 digital for the Crest. That'll bring my total down to $20. I'll get back $5 in Walgreens cash for buying three. Then I'm gonna submit to Ibotta. I'll get back $2 for each of the Huggies. So this is why I bought the 32 count because the Ibotta rebate is 32 count or higher. Then I'm also gonna submit to Shopkick. I'm gonna get back 1,100 points for each one. It is a limit of two. So that's gonna be $8.80 coming back from Shopkick. And then I'm also gonna submit to Fetch for $2 back on the Huggies. That's gonna make all three of these items just 20 cents. So my store finally has two of the same scent of the Axe body wash. So I'm gonna grab two of them. They're buy one, get one half off and they're $5.49 each in my store. So that'll total me $8.23, but I have a $6 off two digital coupon. That'll make it $2.23 for both. So this is everything I'm picking up for my first transaction. So on this one, I'm using the spend 15, get back $5 in Walgreens cash. So all of this is gonna total me $35.91. We have a $6 digital for the Axe, a $4 digital for the Huggies, and a $1 digital for the Scope. So that's $11 in coupons. So I have to pay at least $4 out of pocket to reach that spend amount so I can use $20 in Walgreens cash. So after the $11 in coupons, that brings my total down to $4.90, or no, I'm sorry, $24.91. That way I can use $20 in Walgreens cash because I'll be paying $4.91 out of pocket. So that plus the $11 in coupons equals my spend amount. All right, so now we're gonna move on to my spend 20, get back five transaction. I'm gonna grab this big 115 ounce Tide. It's on sale for $15.99. Buy one, get back a $3 register reward. So I have a $3 digital coupon, so I'll pay $12.99, get back that $3 register reward, making this $9.99. Cosmetics this week are buy two, get the third free. So I'm gonna grab one of these classic blushes for $7.79. And then I'm gonna come down here and grab two of these eyeshadow at $5.99 a piece. So since these are buy two, get the third free, I'm gonna be paying for the blush as well as one of the eyeshadows. So that is gonna to total me $13.78. I only have one CoverGirl coupon left, the $3 for the eye, but then I also have this $5 coupon that I ended up getting last week. So I didn't count this as a reward earned, so I'm not gonna count it as a re reward spent, but it is still a store coupon. And when you use a store coupon, that does not count towards your threshold amount. So I'm gonna have to subtract $5 from my total amount to reach that $20 mark to get back my $5 in Walgreens cash. 
but then I'm gonna submit to Ibotta. I'll get back $3 for each of the eyes and $3 for the blush. So $9 coming back from Ibotta, making all three of these a $3.22 money maker. All right, so this is everything I'm doing for my second transaction. And of course I picked up those money maker cough drops again. So all of this after that $5 store coupon equals $27 and 45 cents. I'm going to use that $3 digital for the tide and the $3 coupon for the cover girl. I'm also going to roll $10 in register rewards. So that'll bring my total down to $11 and 45 cents. But with my coupons and register rewards, I'm only at $16. So I need to pay at least $4 out of pocket to reach that spend amount between my out of pocket cost as well as my coupons. So that bringing my total down to $11.45, I'm able to use $5 in Walgreens cash. So I'm gonna end up paying $6.45 plus taxes out of pocket for this transaction. All right, let's check out and then we'll go over my receipts. All right, so here we are with this goodness. I think this was the quickest I've ever been in and out of Walgreens. They actually had everything that I was looking for. So that was awesome. And everything worked out so well. Oh my gosh, so excited. So let's just go over my receipt. So here you see the two cough drops at the buy one, get one half off. The Axe Body Wash, buy one, get one half off. The Crest for $4. The Huggies, two for 21. My three digital coupons came off, the $6 for the Axe, $4 for the Huggies, and $1 for the Crest. So my subtotal was $24.91. I did use $20 in Walgreens cash, had a subtotal of $4.91. And then I got back $10.23 in Walgreens cash, which is the five for spending 15, as well as the five for buying the three deal of the week deal of the week uh, deal. <laughs> and I got back the $5 store register reward for buying two of the cough drops. Then this one here was my spend 20 get five. So again, there's the two cough drops. The cover girl buy one, buy two, get the third free. There's my tide for $15.99. So that's that five off five. That's that, um, or what is it? Cosmetic coupon that I had. And then there's my $3 coupon for the cover girl, my two $5 register rewards and my $3 digital for the tide. So my subtotal was $11.45 and I used $5 in Walgreens cash and got back $5.30 in Walgreens cash. So all together, now the register rewards I use, I counted those as rewards earned. So I count those as rewards spent. So $11.45 plus the 10 is $21.45. This $5 cosmetic coupon, I did not count. So I'm just counting that as just a regular coupon. So $21.45 plus my $24.91 subtotal on the other transaction brings everything here to $46.36. I got back $15.53 in Walgreens cash. Oh, I forgot to show you this. Um, why am I so bad about showing these? I did get back the $5 store coupon for the two cough drops and my $3 register reward for the tie. My bad, guys. So I got back $13 in store rewards. Then I got back $14 on Ibotta. So it was $4 for the Huggies. Um, $9 for the CoverGirl and I hit my $1, um, midweek bonus. Mine was like a dollar for five, but I also went to Rite Aid today. So stay tuned for that video. Um, and I'm going to get back $8 and 80 cents from Shopkick for the Huggies. And I got back $2 and 29 cents on Fetch for the Huggies. So that makes everything here a $7 and 26 cents money maker. So really, really happy with Walgreens this week. I don't think I'll go back this week. It's a little bit of a drive for me to Walgreens. So I, I try to only, I only want to go once per week, but if the, but like last week, the deals were like really, really good with all those rewards coming back. So I just, I went again, 
But yeah, still happy with this haul. That is what I have for you. Let me know if you went to Rite Aid or no. Let me know if you went to Walgreens yet this week. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. And until then, stay in coupon mode. Bye, friends.